Yo, what's going on, guys? We're back again for another video. And EA released another Evo for us to complete, man. A team of the week one as well, man. But the upgrades don't look super, super insane. It's only a plus two, maybe a couple plus threes here and there, man. But we do see here on the screen, man. Morales in for. crazy crazy card man i mean he looks pretty solid man it's only 50k i believe 50k coins or two dollars and 50 cents you know using people points or eafc points man not too bad i don't think i have any active uh informed right now in my club but yeah i think i've been throwing them all into like 84 uh team of the week packs there's player picks you definitely put them into this if you want to put them into your team maybe get someone a little bit more usable but we do have them pulled up here from foot.gg so shout out to them as well we do have a couple that i think are pretty good i mean alaba looks like a solid solid Gonna go up in price. Alaba in form 86 rated. You'll see he's probably gonna go up to 88, man. So team of the week upgraded with the 82 pace, three star, four star man, 88 defending, 85 dribbling. So this card looks like a super, super nuts card. Plus, he plays left back. You want to move him in game to center back or something. Very solid. 87 uh passing as well, which is very solid. I mean, Real Madrid links definitely a W man for sure. Next, I did choose out. I think Pal Tor is definitely another good one for uh Premier League. He has two star, three star, medium, high, 78 pace, 80 rated as well, 89 defending, probably one of the best ones for sure. He has 90, oh no, 90 head, heading accuracy, 90 standing tackle, definitely a W card for sure, in my opinion. I would definitely maybe go with this one for Spanish or maybe Premier League links for sure. I think he's definitely a W card. I mean, you could use his gold card for the Centurion center back, but he definitely surpasses that with better pace and stuff like that, man. So definitely a good card in my opinion. Like, like I said before, we have Morales and stuff. So he was a good, pretty solid Spanish striker, four star, four star, definitely carries him. He's not the fastest, but I mean, if you have a good link for him, definitely I'd try him out for sure if you guys want to use him. I mean, for 50k, I mean, informs are already there. Informs are almost at 50k, almost extinct and stuff like that so far, man. So, I mean, if you're usually spending 50k, you already have a inform untradeable, you want to put him into this upgrade. I don't want really to see the problem with it, man. It's someone more, a little bit more usable. Tamezi, I think, has been pretty usable this year. He's had an EVA before with the radioactive. And this card was an absolutely insane with 3 star, 3 star, 85 pace and stuff like that, man. But this one is around the same. 3 star, 3 star just, just doesn't get the, the same links, I think. So if you guys didn't do that one, you already used your radioactive EVO. You want to use a team of the week EVO for this one. I mean, definitely could do a 3 star, 3 star, medium high. Definitely a solid card. 87 dribbling, 85 defending, 87 pace. And you can play midfield as well. CDM center mid. So if you want to put him in the midfield, you can definitely do that as well. Yeah, French can't go wrong. Next, we have Timber. Timber's had some special cards already. I mean, he's better than this one. Is radioactive. You guys use these other Evo paths. This one's definitely better with it. And he has dynamic, you know, dynamic tax. So definitely a W. CDM cam center mid can't go wrong. Three star, four star, high medium. It's the only thing is he plays in the air division, like I said, man. So air division not the best league but you know what man solid stats with 89 dribbling 80 defending 85 pace and 87 physical so solid card in my opinion definitely another good card 91 agility 90 balance man like what a card in the midfield man for sure for your teams bro and then last we have santos here colombian player she looks pretty good i think she had a, uh an sbc i believe and she was like 100k man so for 50k i mean this is way better than that one so three star four star 80 pace 81 shooting 86 passing and dribbling 64 defending not the best but more of an attacking player for your team is 79 physical she has pretty good stats as well man. i mean her agility battles out the craziest man but i think she's definitely a good card pretty solid link with atletico madrid uh david alaba probably i think is the best one in my opinion man but nothing too too you know crazy standing out to me man. i think it's probably another filler evolution for you guys but for 50k you can't go wrong maybe mccabe i mean she looks okay man but only 76 cards eligible for this man but as you guys can see from the list, man, nothing too nuts. Maybe Saul, man, you know, I mean, he looks like a pretty solid card as well. Using his Evo for team of the week upgrade. See what he gets here. I want to see if I can scroll down. Yup, 79 pace, 80 dribbling, pretty solid stats as well. Good link to uh, Lorente. Maybe have that Lorente 87 Evo. You can link him to this guy. Pretty solid. I mean, his pace is not the craziest. Maybe you should throw a shadow on him. Let's see him with that. Boom, 87 pace, 92 defending. Looks like a crazy card with a shadow. Most of these guys with a shadow probably are out of this world, man. So, in my opinion, probably the best ones for you guys to choose. I mean, not the craziest Evos right now, man, but I'm really excited for, you know, Winter Wildcard, man. So check out that video as well. We dropped that as well, you know, off topic. But, man, check out that video. I'll have it linked below. Probably end of this video, man. But let me know down below if you guys should be using this Evo. Maybe using your Team of the Weeks for the Evolution or maybe just for upgrades, ignoring this Evo. Let me know. I love you guys. Have a good rest of your day, man. Peace.